Retrospect offers several options to make it easier to administer Retrospect clients on the network. To get to these settings, you go to the Retrospect console and go to Preferences. And under Preferences, you select Clients at the top of the screen. And then you have a few options that you can play with. The first option has to do with public and private keys for each individual client machine. This option allows you to specify a password at the time of installation so that all client machines essentially use that same password. This is done through the use of pubkey.dat and prevkey.dat files. Once you've entered in a password inside this screen, Retrospect will generate the pubkey and prevkey.dat files. Once those files are created, you then copy the pubkey.dat file into the pubkey folder of the Retrospect client installer. Then every time the Retrospect client installer is run, it will look inside that folder, identify that there is a public key file, and then automatically populate that key for that machine as, as the installation takes place. An advantage of doing this is that it allows Retrospect to automatically locate and add clients to your copy of Retrospect without a lot of administrator intervention. So as you can see, there's an option here that says automatically add clients using the public keys. And that allows Retrospect to locate those machines and add them to your copy of Retrospect without you having to be there. Retrospect also gives the backup administrator the ability to set a policy to limit the individual settings that users can change on the Retrospect client themselves. So the first option is to turn off the Retrospect client software. This allows the administrator to decide if the user can turn the Retrospect client software off or on. The next option, stop running backups, allows the administrator to prevent users from stopping a backup that's in progress. The administrator, administrator can also uh, limit what is excluded or included from a backup. Essentially, if the administrator wants to force a policy of all files being backed up, then you would uncheck this option to prevent a user from excluding machines at the individual client level. You can also specify whether a client can set their machine to read access only or allow uh, the administrator to write data out to a client machine. Retrospect also has a backup on demand option, and when you select that, you then pick which backup set or which media set you want Retrospect to use when it's writing data uh, for a backup on demand. The administrator also has the ability to specify whether a user will have the ability to do a restore on demand. The administrator can also change this back and revert to use the default settings.